Welcome, welcome, welcome. Welcome, welcome, welcome. All right. This is going to be week four for cancer. Um, have a safe Memorial Day weekend. Okay. Um, and yeah, I will do a video with the full moon. If you guys have a chance to go outside and watch the eclipse, this one will not hurt your eyes. Please do so. Okay. So, week four for cancer. I'm going to use a couple different decks. I'm going to use a couple different decks. Um, mm, it's actually kind of getting pulled to maybe use something else, but we'll leave it at this right now. Oh, that's weird. That just fell out to... Um, regret and loneliness. I know I can't change the past. Loneliness. I know that I'm never alone. So these are lessons, right? So you're either dwelling. I don't really feel pettiness. I, I don't feel this energy actually at all. Um, maybe it just didn't kick in or majority of the collective are in different energy. So... There's something going on with the past where you're like, shit. I, I actually almost feel like that could possibly be a past life feeling. Um, I also kind of feel like somebody's like, man, I don't want to be alone the rest of my life. What am I doing? Because what is that saying? Like, this is the world with people around it. What is that? Um, there's like a particular saying, like, no, the world goes around, but like, there's a saying for that, and that's what I'm feeling. So if you're feeling lonely, honestly, like, you're never alone. Um, guides, animals, you don't have animals, you know, guides, nature, I mean, you know, um, it's a small world after all. It's a small world. I, I don't know if I'm picking up on like when the kids were little and, and there was like a cartoon. Because this, my intuition is telling me this is, I mean, definitely different. Some of you, yes, on the more Dane level where that's absolutely what happened, is what's happening. But for a majority of you, it's it's symbolic. It's um, it's It's deep. Hmm. It's a small world after all. I mean, I know these all cards, you know, are symbolic, but um, is there something symbolic when it comes to people around the world in a photograph or an image? I never know how to do something. Symbolism. Examples of symbolism. So, okay, so... There's a, there's a whole bunch. So, so basically, there's something with symbolism. Because I, I do feel like that's happening for some of you, but not to the extent where I'm reading for the collective, if that makes sense. So, to me, it's almost like something circling back around. All right, so cancel week four. Cancel, please. Week four, May 2021. So you're watching someone, you're researching, got metamorphosis. I think you're researching, but you're doing something on the down low too. Oh, one more for fall. So I don't know if it's like harvest. Sorry, my parents must be um, vacuuming. Okay. Oh, shit. Fuck, man. Four? Really? Okay. Since fall, shit's been going down. There's been a separation. There's been something that went on in the household. Some type of... Um, some type of conclusion, right? Since fall. September, October. Harvest time. Um, some type of disruption that 
I don't, this was reversed, so I don't know if you've been avoiding this, you're letting your ego get in the way, pride, like this is something that ended in the fall, but if it's still here, you, it, prime example of Mercury, it's not going anywhere, okay? So to me, you're trying to, you're watching something, you're researching, you're studying, you're buying. There's something in secret here that you're doing. I can feel it. Um, buying, researching. You're not telling anyone. So you're transforming something secretly. Or someone you're dealing with is. And now there's a conclusion. Like something's wrapping up. So this is transforming. This is dissipating. I don't know what you're doing there. <laughs> Something in secret. And normally this card's more like stalker. Observing. Not doing much. Right? Research. Um, some of you, it could be somebody using a fake name. But... There, there's something more, no, that's like, mm, no, that's like research or something. All right, cancel week four, please. We got a coffin, endings, bring new beginnings, growth, change, liberation, transition, which that makes complete sense because this is a conclusion of something, okay? So something's still being wrapped up. And then you have talk and interested, conversating more, waiting messages, text message, emails, hovering, a little bit of anxiety going on. You know what's weird? I just said, if you're dealing with somebody from the past, I guess this would, these would make sense. It's the hidden truth, right? But something just told me that like this is actually a message from a, someone's spirit guide, which is... Never, ever in the book of forever would I say that with this deck, okay? So, hmm. I almost just wanted to clarify that, see what's kind of hidden, but I'm going to clarify that in a second with something else. So, I don't know if this is a message from somebody, an ex's thought, an ex-friend, it is it's someone current... I don't think you'd be looking for this type of message because that's wrapping up, possibly. Um, I want to feel that way again. Yeah, see, like, loneliness. So something is going down. So I was in love with you. I don't think that just, like, goes away. But um, I don't know if you're saying that to your spirit guy. I, that's very strange that that came out like that. I'm not going to lie. That's, hmm. let me get one more. So I do see the transition, which is fabulous. So something's concluding. I'm becoming a better person. So this is, this is good. Some people could be hiding by material stuff or, um, that could be, you know, work, working too much. So, gosh, uh, why are they choosing out a vacuum? All right, so tell me about this observer. This is, something's being done in secret. You could have a secret admirer. I, I think it's more than a secret admirer. Yeah, see, this is, this is working, but the Eight of Pence is also research, studies, hobbies, um, going back to school. But then we have judgment. So again, it's like coming back around the, the corner, the mountain. It, it's like making a judgment call. So there, it's either like stalking, watching, you know, Facebook, social media, YouTube, anyone that's kind of like doing research. So this is a judgment call. This is somebody who is transforming something in their life, which is great after an ending. You could be researching a job, questioning, do I want this? Do I not? I think this is where I'm 
feeling the, the guides. Like there's more than one person guiding you. There's something going on here. Um, this reminds me when I just started my spiritual journey looking into crystals and it kept pulling, pulling me um, to tarot and I was like, no way, I was petrified of tarot. You know, and it kept, every time I went for a crystal, you know, I talked about a wand of research astrology, it would bring me right to YouTube. So, you know, slowly but surely, I was like, oh, what the frig? It was so taboo to me. So, I like I said, there's something secret here. But it doesn't look bad. This is somebody who wants to feel that way again. So there is someone who's kind of lonely and, and feels bad about the way something went down. So, to me, it could be you even working on you. And you're just not telling somebody what you're doing. But you're, you're going through a massive transformation. And there's some type of conclusion. So I don't know if there's like a divorce or paperwork, child support. I just thought court. So I don't know if court is in like, my name's Courtney for all you little newbies. But or if it's actually court. So something's in the works because we have conclusions. So it's either something that's not taking place there was like a truly an ending and you held on because your ego's in the way. So this is like fighting an ending. Yeah, see, nine of swords. So cruelty, stressed out, having a hard time sleeping. Like things are not, would not be good. Like see, yeah, uh, chariot reverse, wanting to move forward but not moving forward. You're just stressed out how something, you're stressed out on how something's going to play out. In the five of cups, disappointment. So either you or them. But I, I, you know, this is this is an ending. This is a conclusion. So I don't really want to focus on that because you have a transformation twice. And someone's going to be reaching out to you. Possibly second chance. But there is something in secret. So if somebody does want a second chance with somebody because things are changing they want to feel that way again it's happiness who doesn't want to feel that way so I don't know if you're not talking to somebody um but you have you have messages coming in yeah see what talking you got justice and the prince of swords this is somebody again who's kind of just watching from a distance trying to figure out how to balance out the scale scales so something's going to go in your favor Something's being balanced. The song that just came to me, Let the River Run. I don't know. Let the River Run. I don't know. Is that like purging? I don't quite know what song that is. Um, so this is, this is positive. Look at metamorphosis. Oh, yeah, the world. What, the universe again right here. Okay, so there there is a conclusion. There is there's a new door. This is a, a congratulations, and with the five of pence, I don't I don't you're just you're worried. I don't know. I don't see anything that's telling me you need to worry about money. I think you're just worried on how something else is going to play out, especially if this is part of the situation. I I feel like it's two different stories. Okay. Um something's wrapping up and you're, you're stepping into something new or you were seeing somebody since fall and all shit broke loose and you know you've been guarded with pride there and it's time to wrap up but I don't I don't see it like that like possibly this could be a second chance somebody wanting to roll back around or this is something else that was going on in a period of your life that is now being finalized and I did say court and that's this it could just be own judgment call like a universal judgment call hmm but yeah see no endings new beginnings so there's an ending with a new beginning taking place all right so if this is you and you're kind of like eh, I don't 
I do see a little disappointment in, you know, the five of pence again is, is like that. So I get that. But that also means major change. Like you can't regret what went down here, there, anywhere, right? Per, I mean, you can, but don't hold on to it. You can't change what went down, right? So this is like congratulations. So it's almost like you're secretly, I'm telling you, it's like a secret. You're doing something. You're secretly transforming your life and making moves. Something literally is wrapping up and you're about to transition into something new. And then next thing you know, you got conversating more, awaiting messages, text messages, just hovering. So it's, it's kind of like you're a little stressed out, like I said, but don't, don't worry about it. Like this is going to be a good transformation. Okay. So again, if this isn't secret for you guys, it, it's just you becoming you again. And you're like, yes, I'm tired of what I was doing, how I was acting, how I went about things or what person, place, thing, regardless. Right. So this is good. You're definitely going through a transformation. And I'm telling you, like, this is a big congratulations. Like, so you're worried about how this is, but I don't see that you have to. I feel more positivity with this little pile of secrets than to be worried about this. And the scale is going to be balanced with talking. Like something's going to go in your favor. Whatever's fair, just, and right is going to go in your favor. And it's somebody who probably wants a second chance and is working on things secretly, not telling you. You know, it's like the balance of the, it's, it's, it really is the balancing of the scales. Let's see if I can get one more for the observer. I want to wrap this up and we'll go to Patreon. Yeah, see, it's not really going to tell me much. It's just contemplation. All right. So like I said, it's still somebody who's trying to figure out their next move. Again, secretly by themselves, like, but honestly, it's, it's not a bad vibe. Okay. So try not to worry. And you're, you're right, you can't change the past. So I, I do feel kind of negative thoughts versus positive thoughts, but I think it's linked to something or someone else and how something's going to wrap itself up. Because this feels, you know, a lot better. All right, I will see you guys on Patreon. I hope you have a kick-ass week and be safe this weekend. I love you guys. Bye.